showtime! Yo, it's shitty Yasuo's, bronze players. Look at this. I told Cool Name I'm gonna watch his Yasuo laning phase and tell him what he does wrong. Listen up, you bronze shitters in the chat. Watch along, because I only do this, I'm only gonna do this once. I don't do this very often. Look at how his bad lane, his laning phase is, and I'll explain every single reason it's bad, okay? Why are you giving her lane pressure in level one, number one? That, that's, that's number one. I don't know where, why the fuck you're sitting on the side as if you're fucking fake or think you're cool or some shit. Walk up. You're in a melee versus melee matchup. Yasuo versus Aurelia. You harass her. You do not let her free farm. Anytime an Aurelia goes for fucking CS, you auto attack and you Q her. You poke her. Okay? That's how you win your lane, number one. This is fine. Okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's not, a, it's not big of a deal, but I'm just explaining. So you should sit here. Auto. Okay. Mistake. What's his mistake, chat? You guys got a chance to learn. Aurelia's Q just missed off the minion. She didn't get a reset. Why is he clicking Q only? Look at this, he runs away. One, you are not scared of her. She fucked up Q, she has no Q. You know what you have? You have auto and Q. Number one, do you think it's smart as Yasuo to just go like this, Q only, or do you auto Q? Think about that, animation cancel your fucking auto attack with the Q. Get an auto Q auto. That way you win the trade. Always auto Q auto if you can. You still win the trade, but you would have won a lot harder, too. And there, a mistake is to you should walk up. Look at this. Aurelia has no Q, right? Look at this. You auto-attack trade? Why are you running away? You have the advantage with your knock-up, your tornado. Walk into her, make sure you can get the NATO land. You hit the NATO still, but that was a long-range NATO. You should pr try to guarantee it with just a close range. But so far, you're winning lane. You're doing good. You're doing fine. I'm just gonna criticize- listen. I'm criticizing every single thing, chat, not to be a dickhead, but to teach you, because I'm teaching you every single mistake that I'm catching. You should look to kill that one melee minion over any other minion to get level two right there. And now you should be abusing your- Dash in! There's a perfect minion right here. You see this blue minion right here, chat? You dash in, you dash in again, you auto Q, auto dash, and you one-shot her, pretty much. You have so much lane pressure with this HP advantage. You have passive shield. As long as you don't get hit by her, her E, you will 100% murder her. And if you get hit by the E, walk it out. This is good. Like, this is where I would fight her. Wasting Q on the minion, that's fine. Oh, good dash. That was good. Good. Bad Q, but it's okay. This is where you just auto her. What I want to see is him auto attack, not use abilities. There you go. And saved Ignite. Well, good. Very good. Respect. Good start. Good start. There's a lot of mistakes made, but still got the kill. So, we'll give it to you. Okay, you shove the wave and you reset. That's good. How much gold? Okay, there. I was about to, I was about to roast your ass. If you bought... Boots? Okay, look. You see how we bought boots and a dagger? I was about to flame him. If you're against Aurelia and the Ramish jungle, build double Dorans. You need more HP in lane. You need to survive survive their burst. You need to survive laning phase in general, and you want to sustain sustain. Double Dorans is just better. Okay, this is fine. This is where you should harass her. You you're winning this. Look at look at the item difference. Look at the items. If she walks up for the CS and you don't kill her, I'm gonna be really fucking pissed. This is good. This is perfect. This is perfect from you. Wait. Are you fucking stupid? Are you fucking hurt in the head? What is wrong with you? Are you dumb? The whole point of you windwalling there is to not tank the minions, but set up a freeze near your tower. Because the, the way that this is working right now is you have a lane and you have a lead in the 1v1. She cannot do anything in the 1v1 versus you, right? She can't jump on you. She can't do shit. You're windwalling the minions. You sit here and look at this wave. Look at your wave. Your wave is going to walk up and be right next to those minions. It's going to line up right next to those minions. And it's gonna set a freeze right next to your tower. You can't get ganked. You have infinite pressure and she cannot see us into your face. Instead, you just kill the minions for no reason. So there you should always set the freeze. Unless you're trying to set up a gank, but even, no, not even, fuck it. No, you're stupid, you're stupid as fuck, but it's okay. Next mistake, we'll keep going. Brain damage into hurt in the head. I'm proud of the progress, yeah, that's okay, not. Cool name is my boy, he watches the stream a lot. I'm flaming him, not in terms of being toxic, but the only way to get through to his, his brain is like flaming, because you won't learn it otherwise. Yeah, when you have a lane lead like this, you don't want to push because you give them a chance to CS. Okay, keep fighting, keep fighting. Oh, these Qs. Ah, you're dead. Um, give me a sec. Uh, Alright, let's see your mistake. Chat, what's his mistake here? What's his mistake? One, fucking up the wave here. Okay, this is why you're really fucking stupid. Don't mean to be toxic. But look, you have a perfect freeze here. The map is so dark. It is so... Look at the map. Look at the map. I can't see it. You have no wards. It's 
four minutes in, you have zero wards. Why are you pushing? Why are you pushing? You can't see? Look at the map. Bruh. Look how dark this is. And instead of setting a freeze right next to his tower, look what he does. Look what he does. Hey, what's up, guys? It's Mo here, and here's 10 advanced tips on Yasuo. He just starts pushing. He starts pushing and then fighting. Look at where you're standing right here. When you take a fight like this versus Aurelia, look at where you are and look at the map. I want you just to look at the map. Why are you stepping this far up when the enemy has a Ramus? You're, you're, you're asking to die. You're literally just asking to die. You even have two wards you haven't even placed. You literally haven't placed any wards yet. I'm too greedy with my, my one kill mo. I'm brain dead player. Hey, don't worry about it, bro. We're, we're, this is improving. I'm trying to help you out here. So there, in every situation, you set the freeze right here with these minions. The way, look at this. This is perfect. You, you walk up here, you put up wind wall, and you trim those two minions if you want. You don't even have to, but you trim those. And then you set the freeze. That way, you can never die to that gank because you can't be that far up in your lane. You're always under your tower. You're chilling. You're eating good. You're eating good. You're eating swell for the boys. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah. So here you die to the gank because you overstep and you kind of hurt your wave a bit, but Lee Sin doesn't help it. Wait, how does she, oh, she shoves in the wave and then you set a freeze. Okay, let's see. Here, you could do anything. You could shove it and look for a roam or look for vision since you have two wards. So this is fine no matter what you do here. I want to see what you do. I want to see, okay, okay, okay. Listen, why the fuck did you just ward there? What does that ward do for you? <laughs> he wards that and then just runs mid. Dude, listen, you shove this wave. You have all the time in the world to do anything on the map. Look at where your Lee Sin just was. Look at your Lee Sin. Chat, I just want you guys to look at the map. This is purely map plays. Look at the Lee Sin. You have all the time in the world to just go follow Lee Sin, go get better vision, walk around the map, get deep wards. Instead, what you do is you walk up to the side with all the time you have after Aurelia resets. You push a, you put a ward in a bush that does not fucking matter because they have Ramus regardless. You think if you see Ramus on that ward, you're not gonna die? You're gonna die regardless. You need to place deeper wards in general. Ramus is dead, Aurelia just recalled. You gotta go, you gotta go make moves happen. My game started, so that's all you're gonna get from coaching, but welcome to Mo Coaching, guys. I hope you enjoyed your stay. We're done with that. Uh, but cool name, I got you, buddy. Improve. That's all I want you to do. I want you to improve. I'm not trying to flame too hard. It's it's actually kind of helpful even though you're mean. Well, the thing is, the reason I'm being mean is because if I'm not mean and I'm not yelling in your face, you're just gonna laugh it off. You're not. You're, dude, you NA fucking players with your mana flow band kleptomancy are so into, you motherfucker. You, f I, I'm gonna fuck you up this, I'm sorry. So I'm getting mad, I'm getting mad. I'm, I need to chill. Wait, I'm not leveled. I, I hate these fucking ugly ass mother like like he's so ugly. I, I swear to God. Yeah, I can farm this wave. How'd you turn that fight? Because I hit cannon for level three. I knew I was getting three off the cannon, so I was just focusing cannon instead of her. And then I had minion advantage. So I trade uh, ignite and flash of hers for my flash, for my ignite, which is worth. Hello, most silver chat flame my plat ass when I asked the challenger mode to coach me. I don't even peek silver chat. Thanks, my really appreciate it. I got you, cool name, just for you, buddy. Hope you learned from that. You know, just think about what you're doing. Whenever you're playing League, you walk somewhere, you just think. It, it doesn't hurt to just think about the movement you're gonna make because it can it, it, it change the whole entire game. Yeah. I want to shove the wave since I'm dead. Why is Braum roaming? <laughs> Thanks. Thank you, bot lane. I appreciate that. <laughs> Kill here. God, Mal Malphite is so useless. <laughs> Malphite is so useless. <laughs> Holy shit. What a useless champion. Finally. Now we gotta make some shit happen. If it doesn't make shit happen around me, I'm gonna be so fucking triggered because I got ganked so many times, I deserve some fucking love from my Malphite. I refuse to let him ult anywhere else besides for me. That's...
He had 1,700 gold on him. Ugh, no. No wonder he did no fucking damage. He had 1,700 gold. Oh, oh, I'm so sad, man. Bro. Who are you, dog? Stop talking to me. Why are these randoms trying to talk to me? I don't know who you are. You stupid fucking bastard. I can't get stunned because there's a monster right there. We should just get out. Like, okay, okay. Are we missing people on the team? I'm so confused. How can they have four people right here and we have two? I feel like that was good for us. We're a team. Yeah, that's what I'm saying, man. I've been saying that since one minute into the game. I have had no team. I, I don't want to hear it. I've been landing 1v3. Is that actually what I said? Perfect. Exactly like you said. Is Tyler1 and Yasuo related? Say that again, I'll ban you. Does my head look fucked up? Come on, team! Yeah, I told you, this Lebanc's trash. The only reason she beat me in lane is because she had 17 people there. She had her whole fucking family tree chill in mid lane, like... Nothing I can do about that, man. When I have a Malphite jungle pre-6. Bro, look at me! I ain't pussy! I run at this shit! Look where I'm running! Look! Hands in the air! I can run wherever the fuck I want! I ain't scared! But Leblanc needs everyone... 16 people with her at all times! Oh! Yo, yo, yo! Say what's up, guys! No, say no more! Mo's on the way! Wait, I wasn't there! Why wouldn't she just ult him? Are you stupid? Yo, ugly J4, you got something to say? Also, LeBlanc, why you need your whole family tree mid in a counter matchup? Why are you mad? Because I play a game to trash talk, it's fun. I go mid every game, you're not special. <laughs> I never said you were special. Or I never said I was special. You're special though. In the head. <laughs> Sorry, my bad. Sorry, that was rude. My fault. No, I'm just flaming for fun. Like, I'm not actually triggered or sad or anything. Like, I'm just having fun. Uh, shit talking is fun. Like, tell me shit talking in video games isn't fun. Like, I know all you guys played COD and just flamed you got flamed all day every day. Shit's fun. I enjoy shit talking. 100 Thieves allows you to call people special? Hell yeah. Hell yeah. I run 100 Thieves. Watch your mouth. This is the reason League of Legends streamers don't get big boners at TwitchCon. Oh, true. Actually. True. You're not wrong. You're not wrong. <laughs> it's too easy. It's too easy. <laughs> Misclick. My shit lagging. Fuck Spectrum. Yeah, my bad. My bad. <laughs> <laughs> she actually disappeared. <laughs> Thank you.
Yeah, this game is fun as fuck, actually. This is like, this is one of the most fun League of Legends games I've played in a while. Just because like, I'm just trolling around having fun. I'm shit talking, I'm having fun. What was that? Can I move? End the game. When he's family, when he, yeah, yeah, bro. Whole family tree. Whole family tree can be against Mo, Mo will still win. You win that game of Type Racer, Mo. Let's type to him all game. <laughs>